everyone, welcome back. Uh, you're here with Lorna Reeves, the uh, founder and director of My Oh My Weddings. Uh, we are the UK's only dedicated wedding planning service for the LGBT community. Um, and today I'd like to talk to you a bit about um, why wait, why wait for your wedding. Um, and hopefully we'll discuss some reasons why actually it makes perfect sense not to wait. You've asked the question, you've gotten a yes, so let's go for it. So, why wait? You can reasonably plan a wedding in 12 to 16 weeks. Yep, three to four months is all you need. Um, as long as you've got a little bit of flexibility around where you want to get married, uh, or certainly where you want to have your reception, um, then you, it's absolutely doable. Um, I know couples and the thought of spending a whole year planning and waiting for an event that they are so excited about right now that it makes perfect sense not to delay. We offer at My Oh My um, a two week wedding planning service um, which is essentially you give us the dates that you're looking at and we'll go away and intensively work on your wedding um, for a really short space of time. We'll pl cram all of your appointments in together um, so it's a bit intense and you might have to take a couple of days from work. Uh, if we can get the appointments over a weekend then we certainly will do. Um, but it means that you don't have to spend the next year all consumed in wedding planning. Um, and it can be that way sometimes. If you're planning your wedding yourself, you can feel like you're spending every weekend um, going to venues or speaking to people that are going to make your appointment and make your outfits or speaking to different suppliers of different types. Um, and if you're not into that, if you work hard and played hard and you just want to be together and be married, then uh, a last minute wedding is definitely something you need to think about. You also get fantastic deals um, booking late notice. Um, unfortunately there are cancellations that happen in the wedding world um, and also some venues will be struggling to fill different dates, um, especially if it's towards the autumn or the winter months you can um, get some really good value for money. You'll still get entirely the same package, um, but probably at a reduced cost. Um, and that's what we work really hard for, is uh, if it is going to be late notice, and it's unlikely the venue will fill those spaces, we'll work to get you the best possible price on not only your venue, but your catering, um, your florists, uh, even your outfits. Um, you have to get a rig along with your outfits. Um, it's tight to order clothes, um, but you can certainly have something made um, and you've certainly got time to buy something off the rack and have it tailored or altered um, to the way that you want. Um, so yeah, it can be really intense and really exciting. You also might want to think about how you're going to fund your wedding. Um, if you've got some cash and it's ready to go, why not do a last minute wedding? Um, equally, if you're going to spend the next 12 months saving um, for a wedding, you could always think about an interest-free credit card um, and pay that off over the next 12 months um, as kind of a reverse saving plan. I know couples that have done that very successfully um, and have made it work so they haven't had to wait for their big day. Um, they've not had to compromise on anything either, um, but they haven't had to spend the whole 12 months, 18 months um, saving super hard. Uh, when they can just be paying it off super hard. Um, I'm obviously not advocating anyone gets in any horrific debt over it, um, but if you've got that option open to you, it's always worth thinking about. Uh, what do you need to remember if you're going to have a last minute wedding? Um, so if you're having civil ceremony, i.e. it's not in a religious venue, um, you need to make sure that you give notice at your local register office. And that needs to be um, at least 28 days before your uh, planned ceremony. So that's your only real time restriction. Um, is the 28 days that your intention to marry needs to be displayed in your local registry office. Um, and you need to have lived in that district for seven days before you can give notice. So if you've just moved into an area seven days, then you can pop down to your registry office and register it. What happens if you find the perfect venue at the perfect price and your guests can all do that particular date um, but there's no registrar available? Well, you can think about um, looking at when the registrars are available and just doing a really private service to do the legal side of it where you 
uh, make your legal vows to each other and sign the register. Um, and then have a celebrant come along to your venue and you can give very personal vows um, and you can really make the ceremony your own. Um, it gives you a lot more freedom around timings, um, readings, music and actually the words that you say to each other then don't have to be um, the legal requirements plus a personal bit. They can be completely your own and completely bespoke. So quite often I'll have cu couples that will get married officially in the registry office the day before or the day after um, the celebrations or at some point in that week leading up to um, just with a couple of close friends or family uh, and then they have their wedding um, on the actual day in their chosen venue surrounded by all the guests that they wanted to invite. So there are definitely ways around it um, plus you get to say nice things to each other twice uh, which I think is really special, really magical. So that's it. There are some massive benefits from not waiting for your wedding um, and the stress and the time consumingness um, is not a, not a factor. Um, it's, it's done and it's planned and it arrives in the blink of an eye and it's just amazing and incredible for your guests too. They get the excitement of the proposal and the idea of you getting married then they get their invitation through the door and then they get a wedding in a really short space of time um, so they get to ride that excitement journey with you as well. My my does specialise in last minute weddings so if you've got something in mind and you still want to get married this year um, please do get in touch we'll be happy to help. Um, don't struggle over anything if you've got queries and questions um, or you just want to make sure that your day runs perfectly uh, please do get in touch and um, we'd be more than happy to help you out with advice um, and we can book in a call. hope you found that helpful. Um, if you know anyone that's just got engaged and can't contain their excitement, please do pass on this video. Um, head over to YouTube and hit subscribe um, and you'll get weekly content. Um, also mailing lists for additional information and blogs and to get your free planning guide which includes a planning list, a budget sheet um, and some colour charts in there as well to help you get the look and feel of the wedding day you want. Find us over on Instagram and Facebook uh, and even on Twitter and I will catch you guys all soon. Have a fantastic day. Bye.